Alright, so we're going to install a pump into a Gen 2 Wagner. Um, this is pretty much standard on all Gen 1s, 2s and 3s, very similar in idea. We have the transducer sitting up there, so that's the transducer jack. And we've got to make sure that that's in. So there's our transducer jack there. So we've got to plug this in. Just like an old telephone socket, nice and quick. Then that pushes in, followed by lining up the pump. This is a T-slot pump. So with a T-slot pump, you don't have to set it up for a pin because it'll just slide straight on, or it should. So I'll get it to the point where it's in, and then I'll try and push it in by hand as much as possible because I want these locking pins here, one there and one there, to line up with the holes in the pump itself. Now, it's not always easy to do, Especially with a new pump, just takes a bit of jiggling. Sometimes you might have to use a mallet. So we'll line that up. Yep. So there's our pump put lined up and pushed in. Get our two bolts. These are three eighths. Always imperial with anything American, whether it's a Graco, Wagner, or a Titan. And remember, Wagner and Titan are the same pumps, same manufacturer, same owner, just labeled differently. So I don't push it all the way in on one side, I try and do it as uh, both sides so I can bring it up nice and smooth. Yeah. Nice and easy, no rush. Now I'll hand tighten it. One more twist. Alright, so there's our pump. Okay, so now we'll put our lower valve housing. I'm just going to put a drop of grease on that O-ring. Just to keep it nice and lubricated. It's a bit more than a drop, but it'll do. Okay. That corner, or this corner here, lines up. The back corner down there. So right there. So that's the way this sits properly. Give it a slight tap. Make sure we get it in enough. Now we just got to get our locking pin. So our locking pin will slide across these two slits and should just lock in like that. Last but not least, it's the suction hose. And this one's missing an O-ring, so I'll install that O-ring first. All right, so push this in and we'll lock it in with our circlip. Give it a wiggle, make sure it doesn't come out. That is our pump now connected.